Hi everyone, welcome to IT's workshop. Let us see how to create Maven project in Eclipse ID. So the first requirement for this that you should have Eclipse ID and that to Java Enterprise Edition. So you can select and you can download the Eclipse ID which is for Enterprise Edition. So you must be seeing this perspective tag over here, Java EE perspective. And then you can come to File new and here if you see maven project it's fine you can select it otherwise you go to other and uh, here in this category you can select maven and under maven maven project so now you can say next so th there can be various method for creating maven project like uh, without archetype selection but uh, in this video we are co proceeding with archetype selection so archetype is nothing but uh, a built-in some built-in avail uh, built-in available skeleton for your project so some already constructed skeletons are available structures are available you can pro uh, you can choose those structure for building your project you don't have to create your own structure that's how it's useful and uh, in this here you can select the workspace uh, I would like to proceed with the default one or you can browse and you can select any other workspace if you want I just am proceeding with the default one then you can say next here you can see this is the catalog and different archetypes are available so if you are working with web application you can choose this maven archetype web app or you can choose this quick start which give which will give the basic uh, structure for any maven project so I i'm proceeding with the quick start then you can say next here uh, in group id and artifact id so in uh, under one group there can be several projects and uh, group id you can select according to the your project name or organization name like uh, my organization is myorganization.com or myorganization.org so that org or that dot com that we generally find at the end of your website name like mywebsite.com so you can select that so i'm selecting com group so there can be various project coming under this group and archetype will be the name of your project so it can be like my first and then this is the snapshot this information will be useful while creating jar file or var file for your project so var file and jar file those are the files which are used for deployment and this is the package information so default package dot my first will come with your project structure so this is group ID under one group there can be several projects like that and you just say finish so you can see over here like uh, maven downloads it your archetype ID and all this is scattered so when you do it first time it may take little time like one minute two minute and for all this processing and if you are doing it second time or next time then then uh, then it takes all all the required dependency uh, from the local maven repository so it won't take much time for downloading and one point to remember with maven that your internet should be connected and it uh, it is helpful if it uh, your internet is without proxy so with proxy there are some settings or uh, it creates problem so now you can see a uh, maven project is created the basic structure is created and this is a pom file you can see this is the basic structure so it is jar file and with this name this is the project name this is the group under which everything is coming this is the information we have selected it comes with JUnit dependency and you can add further dependency according to your requirement so we have got basic java library and maven dependency right now only one maven dependency and this is package for test 
right now only one class and here also only one class so you can create another classes and packages further so that's it for today and thanks for watching if you like this video please click on like button share and subscribe for more videos like this thank you